I felt the nudge to return to a book that I've been reading for a while as therapy homework, but it's a freaking tome. It's an amazing book, but it keep it kept triggering me, so I kept having to stop. I just learned that brain injury and trauma, it leaves people unable to be self-aware. And I had CPS, CPTSD for a long time. Um, lip picking, see me doing it? The brain stopped being aware of the body. So the person isn't able to feel the emotions more self-aware people feel. Sherry knew that picking her skin was a destructive thing to do and that it was related to her mother's neglect, but understanding the source of the impulse made no difference in helping her control it. And I wrote, me binging and grazing and eating junk when I really want to be healthy. I want to treat my body nicely. I want to, I think, <laughs> I have these urges to do healthy things, um, but I don't do them. And I don't know why. One of the best ways to recover from, and I'm only what, a third of, a fourth of the way into the book, things that are experiences of group synchrony. So drum circle, huh? And choir and putting chairs away before the meeting or after the meeting, right, things like that can bring people back. I just thought that was really interesting.